Hey guys, this is System Test 12, and as you can already see, there's a ton of changes on my Fire Demo board here. Most noticeably, this new DMP XR500 security system. And so, this was removed from a building that I'm really familiar with, and is sadly being torn down. So, a lot of the stuff on this panel I'm actually already familiar with from when it was installed. For example, this box down here is filled with Radionics Poppet modules that used to monitor some of the equipment that was in that building. So I've maintained those zones for the history as well as added new ones to monitor the fire equipment. What you'll also notice is that at long last these two systems are finally tied together. You can see there's a conduit connection coming between them here. And then they are both tied onto the same switch box here now. The DMP will eventually be tied into the same power supply, but right now it just has the plug in power supply that was used in the building. Uh, I don't particularly like that because I would rather have it be all hardwired in on the wood plug, but that's what I have right now. That's what I have to go with. So, anyway. For the signals, we have a DMP rebranded Wheelock NS. Uh, the model number is 923-MCWR. A Simplex 9838 that I recently repaired. It was broken, but it turns out the only thing wrong was just an adjustment on the pitch that needed to be made. And the same unappreciated heat detector that's been here since I built this. And you can't exactly test that because, you know, one shot and you're done. Uh, we haven't seen this in one of my videos in a while, but it's the same Halon system that's always been here with the addition of this radionics monitoring box down here at the bottom, which, as I said earlier, has lots of modules in it. So all of these report to a expansion module within the DMP panel. So you can see all of these are original to that building except for these two over here which monitor the Ansel system. So moving on, we'll take a look inside this panel. You see it's a DMP XR500. What's unique about this panel is this enclosure was originally an XR200, so you can still see the old XR200 sticker up here, but that panel fried about six years ago and was replaced in 2008. So it is now an XR500. Lots of fun flickering lights in here. For everybody to enjoy and I do have the battery for this we got a motion detector up here but since this is a fire demonstration system I'm not going to go too much into the security system operations mostly just what's going to be featured in these videos is the fire alarm system and this will just be monitoring the condition of those panels as you can see there's troubles for both the panels right now because none of them have batteries. Anyway, so let's get this started. The NS or 923-MCW will be coding itself to code 3 and the Simplex 9838 will be in continuous and this 9838 is actually really really smooth. That's operating but I won't be activating it today. So here we go.
So there's the fire alarm reporting. And I just entered the code to silence it. That PDC Waukegan label was again something from the original building that I'm keeping for historical purposes. So, in the essence of keeping this video short, I'll stop the camera and reset everything, so thank you for watching.